Yes, I am sitting in my cat's litter box because I belong in shit. Well, hello there, YouTube. Um, I'm just putting on some lipstick. So, just so my self-esteem is not completely destroyed and I don't feel completely like trash by the end of this video. Regardless of what this video is about, I feel pretty. And that's what, that's what matters, right? Like, don't let anything bring you down. Anyway, so for today's video, I'm going to be reading out a few rejection emails that I received recently. So, the few agencies that actually took their time to write a whole ass rejection email to me Thank you very much. It honestly makes me feel like I'm at least worth a response. And you know what? I think that is, that is, I think that's one of my biggest achievements yet. Being worth a whole ass rejection email. I think I'm gonna go to Spain, sell some drugs, get all that money, and get plastic surgery so I can look like a model. Eh. All right, let's get into the video. Also, what am I wearing? It is a huge like men's shirt with a chain on it. So the first email that I received, I'm not gonna say the names of the modeling agencies because I don't know, you know, maybe like 10 years down the line, they wanna get back to me and be like, hey, listen, we change, we change your mind. We kind of want to sign to you again. By the time I probably have four kids, saggy boobs and, or maybe dead. I don't know. It, it might be a little too late, 10 years down the line, but maybe one day they're gonna change their mind. So I don't wanna, I don't wanna put their name on this video, ruin their reputation, because like 200 people watch my videos. <laughs> Moving on. The first one says, if we have something for you, we'll be in touch. Thanks. That's actually. Well, at least they didn't call me ugly. I've been, I've been waiting for hours that turned into days that turned into months that turned into weeks that turned into months again and years and an eternity up until i i've had five kids and a and a bladder issue i'm gonna put salt in my tea because i don't deserve the sweeter things in life isn't it finer things sweeter things same thing i don't deserve it so it's okay next email Hello Mariam, thank you for sharing the video. We reviewed your details, however, we think we may not be the best fit for your profile. You know what about this? They said that they may not be the best fit for my profile, so honestly, it's on them. I think I'm great. But it's so nice that they, you know, blame themselves and not me, like, just so, because I feel like they just knew that I'm going to cry myself to sleep. Eh. Hence, we will have to pass on your application this time. We wish... You, best of luck for your future endeavors. Honey, listen, this is what my future looks like. <laughs> Remember the time you got caught writing a love letter in fifth grade and you snitched on your friend as well so you don't get into trouble alone? This is karma. You and me both, honey. You and me both. <clears throat> Sorry. Moving on to the next rejection email. Oh my god, I don't think my heart can take this. I can feel it drop to my- Was that to explode it for YouTube? I don't know. <laughs> next email. Thank you for your recent application to MT Models. After careful consideration, we feel you are not right for the agency. Thank you for taking an interest in our agency and we wish you all the best in the future. All the best. They said all the best twice, so I think that's them trying to tell me that I, I, I need that extra all the best. Did you really consider though? Did you really consider? Or were you really careful when you considered? You know what? It's cool. It's not like I haven't achieved anything in my life because without you, I've, I've got on the covers of... I've actually worked with, with a good amount of brands. I'm enough for myself. I can model for myself. Not a lot of people can say that. Not a lot of models can say that they are their own agent. I modeled for my own brand and you know what it's called? It's called Mariam King George.
RIP to the legendary model. Moving on to the next rejection email. Hello. Thank you for considering and sending in your photos for consideration. Unfortunately, after showing the team your application, we don't we do not think that you're going to be quite right for the agency. We would like to wish you the best of luck in finding representation. They showed, they showed their, their entire, entire team, team. My, pictures, my pictures and, and all of them, all said, of them no. said no. no. Yes, I am sitting in my cat's litter box because I belong in shit. But have you seen this? Okay, jokes aside though, even though I got a bunch of rejection emails, it only ever motivated me to like keep applying to more agencies. And honestly, out of the 20 agencies that I've applied to, n none of them have gotten back, actually. So I don't know where I was going with that, I'm just... <laughs> Moving on, um, the last rejection email. I probably have more and I just couldn't find them in my inbox from like a long time ago. Dear Mariam, thank you so much for taking the time to send in your pictures, but unfortunately not quite where what not quite what we're looking for. Best wishes, Mark. Okay, Mark. I did take a lot of time in applying to your agency, so here's what I'm gonna do with your stupid rejection letter. It was actually a blank piece of paper because my printer ran out of ink so I couldn't print out the emails. Positivity, right? Screw you, I can make it on my own. I think I have a paper cut in my ass. Oh my God, Jimmy, I'm not even kidding. Like I've been rejected by so many modeling agencies. Like, can you believe it? Who would even reject me? Like, look at me now. Yeah, it was really hard. Like I went through a really hard time finding representation and like everyone rejected me. Like I was rejected left and right. And I, I was, I never gave up. And I think that's what really mattered. And I'm just like, like every, look, just looking at everything that I've achieved right now, I've, I...